Yo, what's up, everyone? Voss, get off. This is Val Ramos, and today's music producer tutorial, I want to discuss why you should find a mentor. The number one reason why you should find a mentor is because this person, him or her, will be able to correct your mistakes along the way. And in order to become an expert in the craft, you've often heard rules such as the 10,000-hour rule, but I also like to liken this to you must not become too comfortable doing the same task again and again. So if you do not have a mentor, you're going to become accustomed to doing the same tasks, the same actions, and you might merely become perfect at being bad or, or being wrong or being slightly off. So a mentor is going to, going to be able to correct those mistakes, catch them in the early stages, and then guide you towards the right path as a producer. So finding a mentor not only has advantages in the music production realm, but also in the music business realm. In the music business realm, which I would argue was the other half, the other 50% of releasing music and overall building your presence as an artist, he or she will be able to guide you along the way in terms of music business. So marketing, promotion, social media c content creation, reviewing contracts, understanding what a record label should do, understanding copyright and royalties. These are all important topics as a artist, as a producer. And if you ignore these topics, then you're going to be nearly be outsourcing this to a record label or to another party. And that's where unsuspecting artists can be ripped off and signed into a bad deal which could affect you down the road we've all seen some of these big pop stars these hip-hop stars that have signed contracts earlier in their careers and they've basically given away the rights to most of their music and in exchange yes their songs charted really well but on the flip side they lost a lot of the royalties they were that they were probably entitled to so understand that the music business realm is based off of leverage and i think it is best to self-release music initially until you achieve some leverage in the, in the marketplace. And then you can approach deals from a position of leverage. With the leverage, you will have options then to negotiate a better deal. But I digress a little bit. But finding a mentor will guide you and put you in the proper path towards building momentum and achieving your path from A to B in the fastest and most efficient manner possible. So I strongly recommend that you consider finding a mentor. So there you have it. That is my quick tutorial on finding a mentor and why you should find a mentor early in your career. If you have any comments, please leave them below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.